I supposed to get this stupid horse to fit in this backpack? Um, is there any particular reason that you're trying to put a horse in a backpack? Duh, so I can take it to school. Addie, you're starting sixth grade this week. There isn't going to be show and tell anymore. No show and tell? Well, what are we doing in school anyway if we aren't doing show and tell? Oh, the first thing they always make you do is write an essay. An essay? How is that more fun than show and tell? It's not supposed to be fun. So every year when you go back to school, you're supposed to write an essay on what I did last summer. Ooh, that actually does sound fun. I did so many cool things this summer. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yes, but can I have some tea, please? Yes. <laughs> Masked foosball. Ready? Yeah. Yay! <laughs> oh, great genie of the lamp, come forth. Julian, look! <laughs> Je peux vous le rendre, Seigneur, Seigneur, car avec les soldats. See, Julian, writing this essay will be a snap. Addy, this is exactly why I hate writing the essay. Nobody believes what I say. Why would nobody believe you, Julian? You're highly credible. It's not a matter of how credible I am, it's just we do too many crazy things every summer. I don't know, I think we had a pretty normal summer. Is this it? Addy, don't touch it! Hey, I'm stuck. Jillian, I'm stuck to the garbage monster! I told you this would happen. Yep, nothing unbelievable about that summer. Oh, really? So you think having to deal with the Skull of Doom was normal? Hmm. I guess some people will have trouble believing that, but it really did happen, just like when the garbage monster came. Yeah, bringing the garbage monster up doesn't really help your case. Well, what about the book that we had that could see? Teachers like books, don't they? What's happening, Jillian? Jillian, no! Hey, what are you doing? No, Jillian. Someone has to put an end to this. Addy, stop! Oh yeah, that sure is believable. We don't even have the book anymore to show people. Well, if they want evidence, I think we still have that Aladdin's lamp laying around somewhere. Hmm. I'll just wish that something really exciting would happen. All right, your wish is my command. I look as All right, Addy, what's gonna happen? Whoa! So you think you turning into a velociraptor and playing the piano is gonna help your credibility? Yeah, I guess if I show them the lamp, they're still not gonna believe that one. We need some more relatable things to talk about. You know, like that one time the internet went out. Okay, okay, the internet's been down before. We're not gonna panic. I'm totally gonna panic. Me too. The internet's down! <laughs> Can you run and jump for a while like the internet out dinosaur? Why does everything always eventually end up involving dinosaurs? Ooh, I got one. Remember when we rented that summer house? Oh yeah, but the place was a little creepy. Come and play with us, Daddy. And I'd never do anything to hurt you. Well, that's reassuring.
<laughs> okay then. Breadcrumb. 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 I'm just happy because I found the breadcrumbs. <laughs> Here's Jilly. Uh, can't we do anything normally? Yeah, even when we just wanted to get some Toy Story 4 toys, that turned into a whole thing. Addy? What's going on? Plush Rush! <laughs> hey, what is that? <laughs> Jillian, what happened to your mouth? Oh no, Jillian's been turned into a dummy! <laughs> ah, Benson! Hey, you! Say hello to my backup dummy friend! Ah! Get him, Jillian! Hey, I still insist that Plush Rush was a good idea. It was just ahead of its time. That may be true, but it wasn't much fun turning into a dummy. But you were always a dummy, weren't you, Jillian? Ha ha, very funny. At least I can draw better than you. Remember what happened with your stick man? I remember it like it was yesterday. Now rise, rise, rise! Whoa, it worked, it really worked. Now you hide in the hallway and I'll get my sister. You know what to do. Oh no! Addie has summoned her stick figure to life to teach me a lesson about constructive art criticism! You know it! Ah! Well, Jillian, you've convinced me. There's no point in going back to school. Well, we have to go back to school. We just have to find out a way to write a believable essay. Well, we could just make stuff up. This summer, we went to the beach. We had some friends over for a party. The end. That is non-controversial, if a little boring, but it is a lie. It's just a little bitty lie. Eh, I think we should ask Daddy for his advice. I guess so, but where are we going to find Daddy? Ah, get back in there, monsters! Oh, hi girls. And people wonder why we don't have a normal summer. Daddy, we have to write an essay about what we did this summer, but we're worried people won't believe us. Yeah, I think we should just go the non-controversial, we didn't actually do it, but it sounds real route. She's saying she thinks we should lie. Well, being the good father that I am, I'm going to tell you that honesty is always the best policy. Really? We kinda thought you'd say that. I think you should be proud of the things you did this summer. Why, lots of kids would love to have had a summer just like yours. Oh, so you told all your friends about all the things you did this summer? Well, maybe not everything. We have to get him out of there! Is anybody home? Girl, That girl gets no allowance. Did it work? Yeah, Dad, your summers aren't exactly normal either. Well, good thing I don't have to write an essay. Bye! Well, now I'm more confused than ever. Daddy said that honesty's good, but he also said that he didn't have to write an essay. Maybe we need to get an outside opinion. Yeah, you mean like someone who can relate to the crazy lifestyle of a YouTuber? Yeah, maybe some adults who understand kids. You thinking who I'm thinking of? Princess T. And Princess Fam. I'm getting them on the phone right now. They'll know what to do. Do you want to see how this conversation goes? Head on over to Princess Toys Review right here. And be sure to watch all the videos in the What I Did on My Summer Vacation series. They're a lot of fun.
Thanks, Thanks for watching. Goodbye. <laughs>